Dear Dr. Cheryl, I have never had an orgasm with my partner. Please help, what's wrong with me? Well, you're in the right place. Welcome to the Summer of Love series, where in the podcast and in these videos all summer long, I'm answering the most important, and let's face it, sometimes painful, love, sex, and relationship questions. If you have one for me, you can email it to me below. Now, let me jump right into some really important information that hardly any couples know. The couples I work with in my 12-week immersion program, most of them are surprised what I'm about to tell you. First of all, about 30% of healthy human women have never had an orgasm. I mean, not once, not with a partner, not with a vibrator, not with masturbating, never. Second, Orgasms for the majority of women happen when the clitoral tissue is stimulated. The clitoris isn't just the little nub that's about the size of a eraser pencil head. It's also a lot of tissue within the vulva, the vagina area. Now, some women like specific, uh, more intense stimulation. Others like a bit of diffuse stimulation. But the fact is there's a gigantic myth. And I got to scold Sigmund Freud for this one. Sigmund Freud, great psychoanalyst, the one who taught us about the unconscious mind, but he was a bonehead in other ways. His biggest faux pas among many, so maybe it's not his biggest, was he said there was something called a vaginal orgasm, which is what mature women had. That's a sexually mature woman had a vaginal orgasm, meaning a penis goes in there and you have an orgasm. And an immature neurotic orgasm was a clitoral orgasm. He was wildly wrong. But between that, between romance, between dumb stuff like sex in the city, I'm going to debunk a myth there. I like the show, but boy, did it miseducate a generation of people and pornography and et cetera. There's a giant misunderstanding that a healthy woman should be able to orgasm from intercourse alone. Not true. You are normal. Again, I'm answering a question from one of you. You said, "Uh, Dr. Cheryl, I've never had an orgasm with my partner. I can orgasm easily on my own. What's wrong with me? Nothing. Now, quick story. All of you have probably heard of or watched, depending on your age, the TV show on HBO called Sex and the City. It was in the 90s. It was about four women who lived in New York City and their super fashionable lives. They were all single at the time, Sex and the City. It was about their sex lives, their romantic lives, their search for love and orgasms. Now, one of the four characters, those of you who are familiar with the show, you'll remember Samantha. Samantha was a wildly sexually voracious woman. In the show, she had sex with all sorts of guys. She was a high-level PR our exec, fancy suits, fancy office, sexy, sexy, and the, the Federal Express guy would come to bring a package. She'd shut the door and they'd have wild sex up against the wall and she'd have a screaming orgasm. This is a super important story. A lot of men and women, I dated a guy who got his sex advice from Sex in the City. Crap as a lover, because the show was wrong. Now, here's the thing. In her real life, the actress who played Samantha, her name's Kim Cattrall. Weirdly, she actually grew up about a stone's throw from here on Vancouver Island. She's actually from the Parksville area. Minor crazy fact. Kim Cattrall wrote a book when she was 42 years old where she told the truth about her own sexual life and her own body. At 42 years old, the actress playing the most sexy character on TV who had orgasms, if you looked at her funny, had never had an orgasm in her own life. Kim Cattrall only had her first orgasm when she was 42 years old, when she had a partner who was a skillful lover, understood the human female body, and helped her learn to achieve orgasm. So back to your question. Dr. Cheryl, I've never had an orgasm with sex with my partner. What's wrong with me? Nothing's wrong with you. The good news is I've got tips and techniques for you. Now, in my 12-week immersion couples program, my signature program, which I'm offering for only one time this year, you're going to hear lots more about it. We're going to open the doors in October. We spend the last five weeks of the 12 weeks taking a deep dive into sexuality. I educate you and your partner about what I just said in way more detail. You have exercises, techniques. Uh, we do a, a class on sex toys, on dark sexual fantasy, on different desire, what to do if you're not making love at all, what to do if you can't get turned on. It's all happening. That's in that program. But for today, here's your quick tip. It's really, really important that you learn to teach your partner how to help you orgasm. If there's a way you touch yourself when you masturbate, have you ever tried a sex toy like a vibrator? You can get beautiful, discreet little vibrators that look like a tube of lipstick. You can carry them in your purse. When you know, and you said you do orgasm on your own, you need to help your guy know what works for you. Now, guys, if a woman teaches you how to help her orgasm, that is a great gift. 
because the majority of men have been lied to and a woman's had fake orgasms with them. And so you think what you're doing works. Honey, it probably doesn't. Ask the person you're with, how can I please you? Show me what you like. Teach me to be the greatest lover in the world for you. Okay, that was today's love bite. Pretty specific, pretty deep teachings. It's just a small taste of what I offer in all of my work. Check out the podcast. But definitely, if you're interested in learning more about all of these topics, you might want to join our wait list for the 12 week program. Let me be clear, there's no obligation whatsoever. When you're on the wait list, it does mean a couple of things though. It means you're going to get the odd goodie from us. It means you're going to be the first to know when I offer my free two hour online couples workshop multiple times this October. Come to that workshop if nothing else. Get your partner to hear this with you. I answer questions on that workshop after I teach you a lot of information. And then a small group of you will probably choose to join me for the 12 month immersion of 2022 to help you make love intentional, to create love that lasts a lifetime in my Become Passion program. We will kick off the third week in October. For now, learn how to help yourself feel pleasure and learn how to help the one you love help you feel pleasure. That applies to everybody, men, women, gay, straight, trans, whatever body you have, the more you understand your pleasure, the more you can help your partner pleasure you and you to pleasure them. Whew, hope the kids weren't listening. I'll be back with you with another Love Bite one week from today. Bye for now. 